Hey guys, Red Dot Shooters here, and here's my review of The Way of the Gunsling by Frank Proctor. If you've never heard of Frank Proctor before, he's a shooting instructor who's a special forces veteran and a competitive shooter. You can look him up here on YouTube. Anyway, he's an extremely skilled shooter with a ton of experience, and he designed this minimalist sling. And today in this review, I'm going to tell you why I think it's the best AR-15 sling for the money. So with that all said, let's jump into it. The first thing I like about it is that it's a two-point sling. I know a lot of guys out there like their one-point slings, which of course have their own benefits and applications. But for general purpose, I prefer using a two-point sling. The reason why is that it just gives you a more secure attachment to your body. You can simply drop the gun, it'll hang across your chest, and that frees up your hands to work and do other things at the same time. Aside from that, you can also sling it across your back if you need to run around or climb or carry something heavy. So it allows you to move the gun out of your way but still keep possession of it at the same time. And a one point sling is just not as useful for that. Another thing I like about this sling is that it has a really smooth slider. Now there are many slings out there that have some version of a slider, but when you put them to use, you find out that they're really stiff and difficult to use. That kind of defeats the whole purpose of having a slider in the first place, because you can't quickly adjust your sling length for different situations. When you're moving around, you want your rifle hanging closely to your body because that's going to be more comfortable for you. But if you need to make a quick shot, having the ability to quickly give yourself some more slack just allows you to aim a little bit better. You also want that slack if you need to reload and manipulate your gun. And like I said, this sling adjusts really, really smoothly. So with one hand, you can quickly tighten it or add some extra slack depending on what you need. Now attaching this sling is extremely simple. There are actually two versions of it and they attach to your rifle in different ways. There's the quick detach version, which this is not, this is a Magpul, but on that version you have two QD swivels, one on each end. The other version is the one that I have that uses the paracord. Now some guys look at the paracord and they turn their noses up to it and make fun of it, mainly because they don't think it'll be very durable. But I've had this sling on this rifle for about two years now, and I've never had any issues with durability, even when I heat the gun up and the rail gets hot. So I think it's a lot stronger than some people give it credit for, and it has a couple of other benefits as well. It doesn't really make much noise, and you can find a way to attach it on almost any gun. Another great feature of the way of the gun sling is that it's small and lightweight. Here's a Magpul sling that I also really like, but my main criticism of it is that it's a little bit bulky. And if you hold these two side by side, you can tell a big difference in weight. Now I'm not sure how much this Magpul sling weighs, but the way of the gun sling with the paracord is only about 3 ounces. And here's the thing, I'm always looking for ways to cut weight on my rifles. So if I can add a sling with a functional slider for just 3 ounces, I'm pretty interested in that. Now in regards to the size of the strap, you can see it's relatively thin compared to a lot of other slings on the market. But even though it is more narrow, to me it feels just as comfortable as any other sling I've ever used. Okay, and the last thing that really makes me a fan of this sling is that it's affordable. Now the QD swivel version is somewhere in the $45 to $50 area, which isn't too bad. But the real standout to me is the paracord version because it only runs about 30 bucks. I think that's a pretty awesome deal considering the functionality you get with the slider. And I also want to mention that it does come in a few different colors, like you can see mine is the tan, but you can get it in black and multicam as well. So all in all guys, it's a lightweight sling, it's easy to install and adjust, and it comes in at a reasonable price. I think it's really awesome, and I highly recommend it if you're looking for a sling for your rifle. Now guys, adding a sling to your rifle is a good idea, but it's not as important as making sure your marksmanship fundamentals are squared away. So if you need some help improving your shooting, check out my free guide where I show you an exercise that can be done without leaving your home or spending any money. It's a very basic exercise, and I use it myself to continue my own improvement. So to get that, just go below in the description and hit the link. Or type into your browser red.shooters.com backslash trigger. Again, the exercise is free, and it did help me improve, so it might help you too. Thanks for watching, and be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe for more gun and gear reviews.